Herb, you've been watching Jordan for almost a week now. What do you like best about his game? Just his energy, the way he attacks the rim, uh, the way he rebounds the ball, both fans in the court. Just his tenacity, the way he approaches the game. He's a pretty good, he's pretty receptive to you know, different ideas when he talks to him. And then he goes out on the court and tries to get out of the court. So that's, that's real fun. How does he fit into the system that you guys are on? a lot of pick and rolls. If you watch him out here, he's the guy that sit most of the pick and rolls. So he runs the pick and rolls and he's rolling. A lot of times he doesn't get it out here. So, But he's, one thing you gotta notice, he's not getting frustrated. Usually when you pick and roll, pick and roll, if you're a big guy, you kind of get frustrated and you stop doing it. He continues doing it time after time after time. So it's going to be good once the season starts. What are you working on him with? Well, he probably needs to work on his strength a little bit. Maybe it's outside shooting a little bit so he can stretch the defense a little further. But you know, those are things he knows he has to work on. It. And when he comes back, uh, uh, probably early, early September, late August, those are the things we'll work on in the gym and the whole with our strength and conditioning coach Greg Rittenham will work with him in the uh, in the weight room. If you were 22 and you guys played one on one, who's winning that game? What kind of question is that? I don't <laughs> 22? You see my numbers at 22? <laughs> so you give it? You give it to him? <laughs> nah, I, I gotta give it to him. Nah, he'll take the nine. All right. Well, best of luck to you this season, coach. We appreciate your time. Thank you.